is connecting the reason is to use to connecting NES Citrix EOS EOS here we have two virtual networks NS for NetScaler virtual network this one for NetScaler and this one for our computers subnet for this we have default if you go to the NetScaler we have another but we are using East US to resource to for virtual network clicking on next is showing you in configuration connection address management dot azure dot com microsoft azure citrix mcs connection name in the subscription id this one like uh, mcs citrix eops is this one both and now finish it will create the connection and you can see the resources over here so you get it citrix eops and here the connection name citrix mcs and the address management dot azure dot com is the azure hypervisor it's created from host file so now after creating this we can create machine catalog using mcs because um, azure only supports mcs doesn't doesn't support uh, uh, pvs in azure environment here create machine catalog and next and this hosting connection is required to open this one if you are not creating hosting part this will be grayed out and you will let, uh, never ever uh, able to select the MCS option so you have only one option another service or technology so this you will create machine manually or it will uh, as a non MCS machine primary zone so create this so next here it's a resource group this one is for compute and this one for net -scale. This you will find the MCS image. So in this one, MCS you you can see the M MCS image, and MCS image only supports unmanaged disk for Azure environment. If you created this uh, MCS master uh, catalog server or master image in with the managed disk using the managed disk it will not be visible over here so it's only visible if you are selecting the unmanaged disk okay now select it next is the selected vsd cache where you will open and after this it will show standard opinion this will show you selected type of in my next video i will explain the standard and premium storage but here i am using the premium storage the storage and license so and after uh, selecting the storage it will show the number of virtual machines you want to create you can Select the virtual number of machine and the select the machine size like a standard B1, it's a B1, F1, DS1, F2. These are the standard machine name with the core vCPU and the memory. This click on next, next. This cache size 127 is showing by.